2018, you were a finalist at Miss South India. You won <laughs> Miss Social Media. Yes, yeah. I did. The social media champion that you are. Yeah, another round of applause. <laughs> Yeah, uh, but in hindsight, you always said that that world was very interesting. It was a great experience, but it's not for you. Like, yeah. It's not something that you always want to do. Maybe you're not slightly comfortable. What part about that world did you not like? Uh, what part about that world that you think needs to change? Why were you not comfortable with it? So basically, I entered the modeling field because I wanted to give a stage for my music. I mean, that I don't know how uh, people would take it, but... I wanted a stage at that point where I could go up and I could say that, you know what? Yes, my passion is to be on the stage and just to sing. And I wasn't getting a chance in the reality shows. And I understood that I needed to do something even more powerful at that point. And modeling was something that gave me a lot of authority on stage. As in you own that stage when you walk that ramp. It, it's your stage for that few seconds. And you have a certain personality that you can bring on to that stage. So the plus point of modeling is it makes you feel so empowered. Like you're not scared of your body. You're not scared of what you wear, how you carry yourself. Because you know that's your time. You have to impress people in that time. But one, the other aspect of modeling, which is a major concern right now for a lot of people is you need to have the right body size. Uh, if you're thin, it's a problem. If you're fat, it's a problem. And uh, you need to be okay with people just coming up to you and not telling you things that may not be comfortable for you. As in that's evading your personal space. And for me, modeling wasn't about that. For me, modeling was a chance for me to look good and promote my music. Simple as that. It was crystal clear. But then I started getting comments like, you know what, if you really want to be a model, uh, you need to put on a little more mass on your hand. Uh, you can't be so thin. You look like a skeleton walking in a sari. <laughs> yeah, so, I mean, we do live in a very judgmental world. So there were aspects of that. And I, I felt I'm happy. I mean, I'm super high on life most of the time. Anyone who knows me knows that I don't need a reason to be happy. And I don't need a reason to feel bad about myself. I mean, I'm made the way I am. I'm happy with it as long as I'm healthy, healthy, as long as I'm healthy, touch wood. I don't think I need to bother about what others think of what fashion is. I should be comfortable. So I decided uh, around 2019, I took a call and I said, no, you know what? I'm going to do the shoots that I like and the ones that I don't like can just be there. I mean, whoever wants can just go ahead and do it. I think it helped me build a lot of self-confidence. I, I really am confident on how I should carry myself, you know, how I should be. It made me realize I don't need to be someone else 